Liz Hall. This is called the standard seduction technique. <laughs> A man I met once. rolled into one. This wouldn't be this way if only I'd met you ten years earlier, con artist of the highest order. So clingy, so super smooth, peanut butter tacky. You need a stiff drink to wash him down. And all these, God, how beautiful your eyes are. And smooth talking, good looking, baby, I can make you lines like, oh, but I insist. Well, I'm a cynic. Met too many suave boys, good boys, hey, wanna fuck boys, let them take you home and you're an automatic toy, and they're too sly, too shy, wanna father babies with your big talk, superman, super duper intellect, till they get you into bed. Then it's one notch, two notch, see who's got the top notch, conquer, stomp her quick, this smart ass bitch. But for now, he's humouring me, and I laugh, ha! Say I'll be his friend, analyse his game plan. Is he on the wing or in the centre? It's all so futile. Wish someone would tell him he's totally attractive. I could even envisage us entwined on some sunny afternoon. But he's trying so goddamn hard, it's ping pong in the rain. Thinks I can't see that old long shut down pain. The bankruptcy, the private pact to never try to love again. My sister, this is partly true, has, my sister has a new set of breasts, perky and pert like an adolescent, a full-time job, two children, a house husband and an exhausted expression, but she can attest to her success by two new $3,000 breasts. <laughs> My sister has a new slim waist, though she was loved the way she was. Sliced scar below ribs, four stomach staples. Anitha ties nearly died on the table of the surgeon who said this would make her happy. A new slim waist to compensate for babies. My sister has two lovely new legs. Suctioned the cellulite, waxed all the hairs, paid $2,000 to deny the Rubenesque contours of her womanliness. She's saving now her thin paycheck for collagen injections to her upper lip. My sister is a fashion plate. She buys the clothes designers create, notes from the bank screw up her face. She works to pay for the latest dress. She'll only wear once or twice the shoes that match to make it nice. And she can neither sit nor stand in clothes made only for looking at. My sister has no feeling in her breasts. My sister lives on packet soup and biscuits. My sister's scar tissue hinders her movement. Now she drives a block to the supermarket. My sister's gone bankrupt. She lost her job. They said she didn't move fast enough. My maturing sisters hate themselves for not being society's version of beauty. My beautiful sisters hurt themselves, believe self-mutilation will make them happy. My smart, sad sisters have never believed there is much more to love than a perfect body.